done things because of law. We want to live in a place that we, we live as we want to live. If we want, let's say, if we, we want to make a Pesach, Pesach, it's a holiday, Jewish holiday, mm -hmm. we will do it. But if we don't want to do it, it's okay to, to stay without Pesach. In the kibbutz that I born, which is also on the left side, and not religious, making a Pesach, every year making the Pesach. And then I grew up and I asked me, you believe in this story? No, I'm not. So why should I celebrate it? I found other things to celebrate, uh, okay? And things like this, it, things will, 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 will be done uh, because people want to do it. And if people don't want to do it, it won't be. Uh, and we came to our movement and we asked them, we want to go as a group to build a new kibbutz. In Israel, in those times, there was a place on the map that one day we will be a kibbutz, or other place, one day they will be a city or a, a other kind of village. And our movement have a place like this here in the Arava, in nearby between Eilat and Yotvata, and there's have another place in the Golan Kids. And we decide together we don't want to go to the Golans because it's a it's not part of Israel for me. I won't go, I couldn't make a settlement there uh, which is not part of Israel. So we decide to go to the Arava. I myself really like the desert before and it's a dream for me to live, to build a place in the desert. And that's how the way we start. And uh, if you look, when you go outside and you look out of the pens, you will see this, this how like this area 40 years ago, and look how it look now, I think this is really something, it's make something from nothing, and it's good, it's the, one of the best feelings that uh, I think people, uh, men can have, and I had it, and I'm really happy for it, maybe we go together. Now, during our life, and during uh, the, about the idea that we want people around, for, for me, and even for my uh, child, okay? I don't want them to be alone like we was in the kibbutzim. I want them to open them all the world. So there's a lot of people from abroad came here because they heard about Samar from a friend, that heard from a friend, and they want to come and they call to Samar. And there's a few people here that take care of it. If someone calls, he gave them. And if there's a place for living, they come in for a week, for a month, for a half, half a year or a year. Ever they, ever they want, how much they want, they can stay here, sharing with us everything, compare the money, okay? Compare, and they're not allowed to vote in the meeting of the kibbutz because they are not a member. But all the other, everything is in Samar is open. There no, uh, no key for every nothing. Not the fridge there, not the freeze, not the kitchen. Not the office, not the place with the money. Anyone can take, can use it. If he belong and if he feel belong to this place. And uh, this is uh, the idea. So people can come from all over the world. And we really, I think we're really happy to collect people here around from ever just just to open our eyes, our minds, and our children. Eyes. Other way, this area is far from the center of Israel, and they really uh, feel alone. And I promised my children that, that they live far away from everything will never stop me to take them wherever they want, because I, this is my way, idea to come here, and I don't want them to lose to know about the Galilee. Okay. Or, or a friend in the north, you can have your money and go to the north to meet your friend. So I told to my children, and they have girlfriend, and he told me, Wow, father, what I'm gonna do? It's four hours then, it's cost so much money. And if you have a friend, boyfriend, girlfriend, friend, wherever in the country, for me it's important that you can meet him and talk with him in your age, in your idea, 
just pass, go and it's okay for me. And if they go on a Friday, I'll come back on Sunday. And uh, wow, we have a, an open heart, I think. This is the most important. Most of the people in Samar really have an open heart. heart. So everyone invited.